Yesterday, about 9 p.m., when awake news, team got to the accident scene at the atomic junction where the gas filling station exploded. There was an eyewitness who actually narrated what he saw to awake news, and according to him, at about 7 p.m., they had heard a leakage sound coming from the gas filling station when a tanker was discharging a gas. Then all of a sudden, he had seen, uh, uh, he heard, he actually heard uh, a shout from uh, the gas filling station, run for your life, run for your life. And there was pandemonium. Everyone was running helter skelter. Cars started and they were accelerating at a top speed and everyone was moving. And he actually saw this kebab seller who is actually close to the gas filling station. That is opposite side of the gas filling station. The gas filling station and the kebab uh, seller, they were separated by the road leading to uh, Hacho Agboba. And then this particular kebab seller, according to the eyewitness, the eyewitness, the kebab seller took his meat off the fire and ran, hid the meat and came back to take other belongings and left. After leaving, all of a sudden, the, 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 the fire of the kebab seller caught, the gas caught the fire and the road started burning, the streets started burning before the fire actually went further to the tanker and leading to the explosion of the filling station. Now, the question, where, when we heard this, this morning the Awake News team went to the accident scene to ascertain as to whether what the eyewitness narrated yesterday, there was any iota of truth. To our surprise, when we got to the accident scene, we discovered three different uh, kebab selling joints. And if you can see, you can see from the videos, you will realize that as of the time that the incident had occurred, there were fire around, meaning there was the kebab sellers were roasting kebab. There was a live fire there. Now, uh, if this is so, the question we want to ask is that uh, what actually are the regulators and the authorities doing as far as a closeness of a naked fire to a gas filling station is concerned? What are the managers of gas filling stations doing to actually drive away naked fire from their filling stations? And these are the pictures you are seeing for you and yourself, uh, for, for you to judge. And we need to prevent this. Thank you very much. And this is Awake TV.